Momentum Coffee is the first black owned and operated coffee shop in Millennium Park, and now they're launching an incubator program helping food entrepreneurs. Yeah, husband and wife duo owners Nikki Bravo and Tracy Powell join us now with more. Welcome, both of you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank, Thank you for you. having us. Obviously, you have been very successful because you have several locations now, and I love the fact that the city came to you guys and said, hey, you know how to do it right. Let's help others do it right, too. Absolutely. So what is the steps that are happening? So the steps are happening are one, let's just tell you about Momentum Coffee okay. and why we even got into this, yeah. right? So we're on a mission. We're on a mission to empower communities. Uh, you know, you see some uh, communities where there's lots of coffee shops, yeah. right? And then you see some where there's none. Mm -hmm. That means dollars are leaving, that there's lack of jobs and there aren't places for people to convene. And so one, it starts with the intention of going into under-resourced areas and bringing those, that great coffee and tea and sandwiches sandwiches and um, places for people to convene and even more wanting more people to do that as well so okay. those are, that's the first step so okay so that's how the idea got started mm -hmm. so how does do people you know what let's make some coffee yeah, let's, let's oh, try we're making some first. coffee so All we right. know what we're talking about here okay so Tracy's gonna make uh, so this is one of some of your signature coffee drinks yeah so we brought today the caramel apple butter, which um, is one of our popular drinks at Momentum Coffee, and a seasonal honey lavender latte. Ooh. Oh, okay. So is, so it, is it espresso? Is it uh, what, it, what? Exactly. It? They're both lattes, so it's going to be espresso plus the syrup plus the steamed milk. Okay. Oh, and today okay. we're going to make with, with oat milk. Okay. okay. Perfect. Okay. 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 We'll do that. Yeah. Okay. Now okay. back to the incubator. Um, the idea, I guess, is that you all, because you do offer more than just coffee, instead of being able to have to spread your resources out to actually now bring in a bakery, you can collaborate with someone else. Absolutely, and I'd love to just switch places with Tracy and let him tell you about the incubator. Okay, okay. <laughs> he was the one that when he saw this was like, we have to participate in this. Okay, okay. We have to be able to share what we've learned uh -huh. with others and be able to create some more of those businesses in our neighborhoods. Tracy, you want to talk about the impetus for participating sure. in the, and we'll switch? Yeah, yeah. yeah there you go. Yeah, yeah. Perfect. Yeah. Yes. So, you know, really when we first got started in the business, one of the things that we realized is that in a lot of the communities, you didn't have coffee shops, you didn't have restaurants, you know, in the city we struggle with food insecurity in the, in the communities and neighborhoods. And then so for us, we realized that part of the problems that is really difficult to start businesses, period. Mm, yeah. Not to just say, depending on what neighborhood, it, it's just really a lot of structural things you have to learn how to do. And so when this opportunity came for us to do a grant, we said we have to do it because over the last four years, we've learned so much. Yeah. And we really want to be able to share some of our best practices and maybe reduce some of the hurdles that people have to get into business. And so that was really our main motivation. We want to create more opportunities for people on the west sides and south sides of Chicago. Because so many people have great ideas, but there are hurdles and permits and all these business oh, yeah. things that you may not have any yeah. idea about that you guys have all been yeah. through yourself. Yeah, absolutely. And so one of the things that we thought most about is like really uh, making sure we had enough uh, workshops for people to be able to get a full understanding from A to Z mm. of what they need to do in order to be successful in the food and beverage business. Okay, so there are obviously, as, as Amy mentioned, permits, licensing, but there's also the funding issue. Yeah. Do you yeah. address that at yeah, all? Yeah, absolutely. And so, you know, we are working, uh, part of that big grant that the city did, they uh, also gave grant money and loans. Uh, mm -hmm. And so hopefully a lot of the folks that are part of our cohort, we're going to have two of 20 entrepreneurs. We're hoping that they will all qualify to get funding at some point uh, within the process. Are you all focusing on coffee shops proper or is it food business types of any? It's, it's just any food uh, business types. Obviously we like folks that do pastries yeah. and different <laughs> things because really for us the big opportunity is that uh, people will be able to then, once they get their products together, they'll be able to sell them out of our space. Yes. Right. Yeah. So like a collaboration. Yeah, yeah mm -hmm. absolutely. Yeah. Because, you know, it's really always a proof of concept. So when you're early, you know your friends and family love to buy baked goods and stuff, but will the public like it? Mm -hmm. Sure. Here's an opportunity to get uh, started and try without and, much And a, with a wide audience as well. Yeah. Tell us about Momentum Coffees, because we mentioned you have several locations. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah. So we started our first location in the South Loop during the pandemic, so mm. it was a very tough time, obviously, but we were able to make it through. And then since then, we've opened five locations. Wow. We've got Millennium Park, which yep. I think they mentioned, and uh, also we've got uh, North Lawndale. Hey, yes, that's my hood, yes. Yeah, North Lawndale, Austin. Okay. Uh, where the food incubator will be run out of. 
Inglewood, of course, mm -hmm. uh, and then um, and then I think uh, Garfield Park yes. Conservatory. Yes, 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 yes absolutely. Okay. Yeah, okay. Okay. Which one is that right there? Okay. So the first one you did was the caramel apple butter. Caramel apple oh, that's butter. for you. Okay, that's the one right. And then so try. you brought pastries with, and is this and this is one of the uh, collaborators. Uh, we or one work, of a collaborator. They're, they're, they're mm. a minority, a woman's minority company that does these uh, pastries for us. They've been us, with us since the beginning. Oh, that's and so, awesome. Yeah, so it's been a good collaboration. You know, Nikki, let me ask you, was this born out of a love of coffee, or how did Momentum Coffee come to be? So, um, my husband's always loved coffee, mm -hmm. and uh, so this really was Momentum Coffee and Coworking at our South Loop mm, location. Okay. We had a co-working space, and then uh, we were opening up a second location, and we were going to lead with coffee. Yeah. And then guess what? Pandemic. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> no and, that's just yeah. There. No, well, then, and so then we just led with the coffee, just leaned into coffee, and um, just got additional opportunities. So like you talked about, Millennium Park, and then we got back to that intention of being in those neighborhoods, yes. and really getting people to know that when they're coming into Momentum Coffee, that it's not just about the coffee. That, you're, that you are community. really yes. getting yeah. into community. Yeah. yeah. All, right. All right. So there's lots of places to get into community with Momentum Coffee. As they mentioned, Mo Momentum Coffee and co-working space. You can check out their social media handles and the website as well. It is a .org. going to help a lot of people. Thank you guys so much. This is so awesome. Yes. Thank you. And this is so good. Oh, yeah. Yes. Mm -hmm. I love the lavender. Thank you. Yes, yes, thank yes. you. Thank you.